Arizona, land of canyons, cacti, and scorching sun. But beneath the familiar landscape, a secret lies hidden, a secret that whispers of powerful forces at work deep within the earth. A crack, a rift, a tectonic mystery unfolding right beneath our feet. It began subtly, almost imperceptibly. Geologists notice subtle changes in the landscape, cracks in the earth, slight shifts in the ground. At first these were dismissed as nothing unusual. The natural ebb and flow of a restless planet. But as the data came in, a startling picture began to emerge. The cracks were not random, they formed a pattern, a line, a rift, stretching for miles beneath the Arizona desert. This was no ordinary geological feature. This was something new, something unexpected, something that challenged our understanding of one of the most fundamental processes on earth plate tectonics. The first sign was a tremor, a slight shudder that rattled windows and shook the ground. It wasn't strong enough to cause damage, but it was enough to attract attention. Seismologists, those who study the Earth's movements, noticed something strange. The tremor's epicenter was shallow, very shallow, almost as if it originated from within the Earth's crust itself. Then came the reports from surveyors. They were using GPS technology to map the land. Their instruments detected small but significant shifts in the Earth's surface. The ground was moving, slowly, almost imperceptibly, but moving nonetheless. These whispers from the depths were impossible to ignore. Scientists began to investigate. They deployed teams to the Arizona desert, they set up instruments to monitor the ground, they analyzed satellite imagery, they wanted answers. What they found would change our understanding of Arizona forever. Rifts are not uncommon on Earth. They are a fundamental part of plate tectonics the process by which the Earth's massive crustal plates move and interact. We see rifts all over the world. The East African Rift Valley, the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, places where the Earth's crust is being pulled apart. But the Arizona Rift is different. It doesn't fit the usual pattern. It's not at the edge of a tectonic plate, it's right in the middle of one, the North American Plate. And that makes it an anomaly a geological puzzle that has scientists scratching their heads. Most rifts form when tectonic plates move apart. Magma from the Earth's mantle rises up to fill the gap. This creates new crust. But the Arizona rift doesn't seem to be driven by this process. There's no evidence of large-scale magma upwelling, no volcanic activity. So what's going on? There are two main theories about what's causing the Arizona rift. The first theory points to the Earth's deep, fiery heart. It suggests that a plume of hot mantle material is rising up from deep within the Earth. This plume is pushing up on the crust from below, causing it to stretch and crack. Think of it like a blister forming on your skin. The second theory is more complex. It involves the intricate dance of tectonic plates. This theory suggests that the North American plate is not a single, unified entity. Instead, it may be breaking apart from within. The Arizona Rift could be the first sign of this breakup, a harbinger of a future where the North American continent itself is torn asunder. Both theories have their supporters and detractors. The debate is far from over. Scientists are collecting more data, analyzing the Rift's every move, trying to unravel the secrets of its birth. The Arizona Rift is not an isolated incident. Across the American Southwest, the ground is restless. From California to Colorado, there are signs of tectonic upheaval. Earthquakes are becoming more frequent. The land is rising and falling. The landscape is being reshaped before our very eyes. In California, the San Andreas Fault, a notorious tectonic boundary, continues to grind and churn, threatening to unleash a catastrophic earthquake upon the Golden State. Further east in the Basin and Range Province, the Earth's crust is being stretched and pulled apart like a giant piece of taffy creating a landscape of parallel mountain ranges and valleys. These events are all connected. They are all part of the dynamic forces that shape our planet. The Arizona Rift is just one piece of this complex puzzle. It's a reminder that the Earth beneath our feet is not static. It's a living, breathing thing, constantly changing, constantly evolving. The Arizona Rift is not just a scientific curiosity, it's a stark reminder of the power of nature, and it has the potential to profoundly impact the lives of millions of people. 
As the rift grows, it could have significant consequences for Arizona's infrastructure and environment. One concern is the impact on water resources. The rift could alter groundwater flow, potentially disrupting water supplies to cities and towns across the state. It could also increase the risk of earthquakes, putting stress on buildings, roads, and other infrastructure. The rift could even have an impact on Arizona's iconic landscape. As the Earth's crust stretches and cracks, it could create new valleys and mountains, altering the flow of rivers and streams, changing the face of the desert forever. The discovery of the Arizona rift has sent shockwaves through the world of geology. It challenges our long-held assumptions about how continents work, it forces us to rethink our models of plate tectonics, and it opens up a whole new frontier of scientific inquiry. This is an exciting time to be a geologist. We are living in an age of discovery, an age where new technologies are allowing us to see the Earth in unprecedented detail, an age where we are finally beginning to unlock the secrets of our planet's deep past and uncertain future. The Arizona Rift is a reminder that we still have much to learn about our planet. It's a call to action for scientists to continue to explore, to investigate, to push the boundaries of our knowledge and to use that knowledge to create a safer and more sustainable future for all.